Hello there, Madra Hill. Welcome back to Byzantium in Imperator Rome. It's 497 right now. We just got commerce income and monthly wages reductions of civic advances. This gives us tribesman output. Mm, that's good. Slave output 10%. And we're on culture happiness, which will help us out so much. And we also have religious advances. This will give us real popularity gain. And a ratery will give us change government. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so we now do have enough to fabricate a claim. If I attack these guys, we don't get much. If I attack these guys, a billion people join. Freight? God, stop. If I attacked... Hmm. If I attacked any of these guys, we'd have a very interesting time. What if I attacked this guy? They would call him Pontus. Now that's interesting. We could take this country and this country, which is 300 pops. Or we could just take the center bit. I kind of want to take the center bit just so I have more of my own territory. You thought it would stop? No, man, we're going to... I'm recording for like three hours, buddy. Let's just jump on these guys. Fabricate claim. Boom. Onto Messinia. I think that's probably best to just try and jump on them as quickly as possible. Wipe out internal stuff, and that way we have a lot of stuff to grab. Do an alliance with Carthage. Unfortunately, they do not want to be my ally. We have a different religion. There's a massive border, and we're competing major power. They're generally not going to want to be friends with me. And once 504 rolls around, we'll be able to attack Thrace and take a bunch of own culture land. That will really help. They're probably going to go up to about 300 pops at some point once they've taken more of Macedon. Which is fine by me. Okay, let's go. Didn't get any tyranny for that either. Okay, so... Excuse me, go there. Now we're just going to be cautious and move our forces up here. Hey now, calm down. Uh, I actually, oh no, this is the, the area we're going. So they have 5,000 archers and 7,000 light infantry. We're going to siege down with our mercs. Oh, you know what? We're going to put our forts on high, on medium, actually. And we're going to give these guys a little commander. 63. Guys are pretty good. Damn. We have some pretty good commanders. It doesn't really matter about loyalty because uh, he's going to die. So it doesn't matter. I am going to have to siege down that fort as well. I really don't want to pay for the mercs, though. Where is their army? There we go. It'd be a good sandwich against Red. It would be, but it wouldn't work, unfortunately. Sad as it is. Okay. Where are their forces? Oh, well. Let's just try and build some buildings while we wait. Do -do -do -do. Where the hell's buildings? <laughs> Skipping past it. Like... 500 gold on just building a pile of buildings. There we go. Hi. Yeah, easy war. It's very easy war, but this will just tide us over until we get to Thrace. It allows us to get our manpower together. I'm just going to use the mercs for pretty much the entirety of this. I'm going to chase their forces. Oh, the Olympic Games. Send this dude. Sure. That means I can change out governors too. Sorry, what? Why is it religious conversion? Oh, no, actually, that is necessary. That's fair. I really would prefer that you did something else, though. Give me tyranny to change it. Lame. All right, let's let's uh, let's chase these guys down. They're trying to be mean and take my stuff. So there's Omen Power. Wrong culture, group happiness. Boom. Sacrifice the old gods cost and rule the popularity gain. Yes. And now our techs are starting to catch up, so we should do pretty well soon. I really do kind of just want to beat these guys up over time. An optional tithe. The head of the devout religious factions approaches a broad smile. That trace of a sickly grinning of his visage, he offers the support of a large portion of the religious faction in turn for a tithe. A bit of cash, and they'll back Diplo actions. Um, actually not a bad idea. Yeah. It doesn't- money isn't- isn't useful to me- to me at all, so I <laughs> don't care. I just don't care. And then, for some reason, they just gave us a massive gift. What the hell are you doing, bro? Macedon is actually beating the crap out of people. Look at that. Rome is starting to grab and in... Oh my god. Syracuse is dead and has been replaced by Agragas. And Brutia, as well, is getting the south section. That's amazing. Look at that. Okay. We're just going to chase these guys down. we got a nice little combined force here. 
Uh, we are going to use the Phalanx tactic. Limit game's concluded. Ah, uh, what are you going to do? You suck. Buddy, buddy, stop, stop trying to run. Actually, we're going to go shock because I just want to wipe them out. Hello. Oh, I went the wrong way. I didn't realize there was a little province here. A little city, even. The siege is one. One pop, two Byzantium. Fantastic. And now, uh, go kill them so they stop taking my slaves. This is very rude, I must say. Ah, oh, look at that. Equal general skill, relatively speaking. Freckless, freckless falls ill. No, not Freckless. Not my Freckly friend. What will I do without him? Hey, no one cares. Uh, they don't have cash for mercs. They genuinely just do not have any cash for anything. Uh, ah, damn it! They're taking my pops! They're killing people! You bet stop. I can beat them, but I really don't want to use my manpower. I really don't. Yes. Wait, is that mountains? No, we're fine. Just in case, we'll reinforce this to the west. Oh, wait, actually, I don't care. They're mercs. I, I literally don't care what happens to them. Okay, and go east and just try and chase them down. These aren't mercs. These are normal, these are normal soldiers. Now we're just going to chase them. Uh, they do have manpower, so they could replenish quite easily, but that's okay. Come on, where are you going? They have quite a few mercs, but they're dead. There's nothing it can do. Hey, look, there they are. Great. They'll attack us there, and we can just wipe them out. Apparently not. They just kicked our butts. No, like we won, but like they didn't die. I was really hoping they would die. You see. All right, there we go. There's some more slaves for Byzantium. Perfect. All right, let's uh, let's send these guys to this little fort, and we're just gonna combine, uh, not combine, rather, all of these little ar little armies here. And basically just stand around and get, uh, sieges. Perfect. Yeah, the goal here is I'm trying to play a bit of a Byzantian slave game. Ah, Thrace has peaced out. How interesting. Thrace- Whoa! Macedon! You beast! So Macedon just got attacked by Epirus, Thrace, and everyone around it, and evidently they won a bunch of amazing battles. They just conquered a gigantic chunk of that. That's fantastic. Which means even more pops for me to take later. It's very important not to overindulge. Shame it. Uh, yeah, pay to the sea, that's fine. Just not to go too deep, you know? I don't want to conquer too much at a time. Macedon is strong, my friend. Holy crap. Look at that. There we go. There we go. And this way also, although we do kill a few pops, it also allows that we get a little bit of stuff moving into Byzantium. Yeah, there we go. Right. Okay. And we're already at 15,000 manpower too, which is awesome. Okay. God, look at all these guys. Jesus. I'm trying to assimilate some of the unhappier ones. Calm, your, calm yourself, buddy. Hooray! <laughs> Good stuff. He was a member of the family, but no one cares. Actually, we do, because he was the Aeropius. Aeropius? Aeropius. Increases tax by 7%. That's fine. Just try and get more pops in Byzantium. How much longer to game? Can you actually form the Eastern Roman Empire? No, you cannot, because there is no Eastern Roman Empire, unfortunately. That kind of thing does not happen for a long time. Uh, their forces are now in the east, unfortunately. 
It's distressing. The warm period. Then the weather's gotten warmer. Yes, it is. From 500, we get 10 years of warmth, reducing unrest and pop growth. This means that it's going to be a lot better uh, to conquer things quickly now. Jumping onto people right now would be a really good idea. And just eating their face. Look at that. They're going to have to stand on this fort now, and they're not going to beat me. Ha ha ha. Get destroyed. Uh, let's also build up some more. Hey, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. There we go. And we don't really need a fleet maintenance. Let's just turn that down. Brilliant. White piece imminent, unfortunately, but it's still being contested, so it's fine. Yeah, give me the slaves! Give me those slaves! Love it. And once this is done, we have to wait for Constantine the first. Yeah, exactly. Take that. Come on, baby, come on. And I might try and go for... Ooh, rate three counter civilization level. Uh, so, loyalty, triumph, cost, and change governor policy. Yeah. Well, triumph, cost, and monthly loyalty. Those are really good ones. I love that monthly loyalty. So, it would appear that you only get pops going to you if they have a commander. Otherwise, nothing happens. That's really weird. You have so much wealth, slave trade rules. Yeah, it does. We're going to have a lot of slaves, my friend. Ooh. 7 10 10 10. The religious faction. Panetios, it's designed to offer support of a family's vast numbers of context in a bit to better organize our, our bureaucratic system. He's curious he should approach us now. Well, why not? And get friends in high places and will be unable to act against this family. Yes, provincial loyalty. Holy crap, yes, please. Okay. What? Oh, there's more stuff here. Oh, whoops. I didn't realize. I had no idea. That's not good. Let's recruit some more heavies here. Ah, you're watching this live feed 24 7. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I really do. No, 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 don't, 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 Hey, could I have access, please? Could, could, I, could I have... No? Okay. Oh, hey, we could just walk past. Oh, dear. Never mind. Well, ow. There we go. Then we have some reinforcements coming from the north as well. Our recently recruited forces. No, no. Hold on. There we go. I love it. Just uh, pull back a little bit here. As long as that siege gets done before reinforcements arrive, we win, basically. Pull back. Yeah. Now we're talking. Boom. Okay. The problem is that we do get that, but that's fine. Boom. 11 AE. Perfect. The Ferraria Elite. I will kill them all. That is gorgeous. I love it. Okay. Oh, yes. So we have expanded really nicely there. In four years, I do want to be attacking into Thrace. Um, where I, when I do attack them... Ah... I will be against Seleucia and Egypt, but there's no way that Seleucia will be able to get access. Uh, how many ships does Egypt have? They currently have 10. Single-handedly enslave the whole nation. That's the plan. So we do have time for one more quick war. Because I do have to wait until the truce is up against Thrace, which is 504. Actually, no, it's only three years, so I might actually wait. I might actually wait, to be honest. Let's wait. And who will uh, who will Thrace be calling in? The Adrissian Revolt, Epirus. That's fine. Uh, as long as we make sure that our sh we have enough ships, which at present we do. Let's see. 
Yeah, let's just get 30 ships together because that would be sufficient to beat the fleets of Epirus and Egypt twice over. And we can garrison fleets uh, across the waters here, which would be really good. Uh, we could try and attack Pontus now as well. The problem is if we try and attack Pontus, I think it's too much stuff to attack. Actually, no, it's probably fine. <laughs> let's just do it. Let's just go into Pontus. They do have 45 cohorts, though. Oh, damn. What is this? 45? Where are you coming from? Damn. Well, I mean, I, I only have 46, so it's actually going to be a pretty high, hefty fight. But I would quite like access to some of their better resources as well, because they have precious metals. Uh, I think that'll be really good. Kevin, thanks for the follow, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much. Uh, it is the wrong culture. It would be 290 pops, which is maybe one a bit more than one-eighth of my total population. My AE would go up quite considerably, though, so I think I do actually have to wait. Cobra Commander, thank you so much for that follow, buddy. Holy crap, welcome to the stream, guys. I'm really nervous and wondering if maybe I should just try and jump into Thrace instead. And just take Thrace and not take Pontus. Adding 400 pops in such quick succession. Ooh, tax. Oh my god, we're so rich as well. We're making so much money. Uh, no, let's, let's move you around. Ow, attrition. Ow. So many follows! I know, right? What's so nice is when you get like a sub goal. When people realize they have Twitch Prime subs, they're like, oh, I can give Twitch Prime for you. And it's just like, you get like seven at once. It's really nice. Like I get a lot of my subs that way. So it is only a couple years and I kind of want to be moving onto my own territory. So I think we're going to wait until we can get on Thrace. So let's, let's go do that. Yeah, let's do that. Let's chill out for a little bit. Just a couple years, just a couple years, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> I was just talking. I was just saying, oh, should we attack them? Should we do this or do that? They actually attacked me. Why would you attack me? You're going to die. You have almost all light infantry, bro. I'm going to eat you alive. Oh, bro, no. What are you doing? What are you thinking? You're going to die horribly. Oh, hell yeah. All right, then. I guess that changes it because I'm 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 still going to get a tick reduction as well because I, I still get point of uh, point two percent reduction because I'm in a defensive war. So that's fine. The problem was if I stayed at war with Pontus and then with Thrace, like one after the other, what would happen is that I wouldn't get that base reduction of AE. Instead, I would only, I, I would be on point, oh, it's actually only point of five left, because Britannia does the majority of it. But still, it would be uh, less. Oh, that's so good. Putin, what's up, buddy? Welcome to the stream. Oh, that's so good. That is so good. Yeah, that is not so smart. That's not so smart. Um, I think I might recruit some more mercs. I have so much cash, and I make so much anyway. Uh, I think I might, and the maintenance is only 11. So I would be losing a little bit of money if I hired these mercs, but mercs are just really good <laughs> and it means I don't have to throw my manpower away. So let's hire these guys. He's got an, he's an eight commander as well, so that's fine. So we're just going to wait until they, they walk up to us. Yeah, let's pawn us as a secret Alexander. Not really. He's 71 years old with cancer and he's cautious, plain speaking veg. <laughs> it doesn't seem it. So we're going to wait for our reinforcements now. Maybe it's because they saw that I had low maintenance, maybe. I, I'm only finding the A is actually a lot better, but oh well. I mean, there's no forces near me, so I'm just going to sit here quietly and waiting for their, wait for their attack. <sighs> Dude, I'm going to destroy you. What were you thinking? Oh, terrible plan. I can't even see their armies anywhere. Yeah, we are losing money, obviously, but that's fine. Alright, so let's... We're going to move these mercs as a priority to go siege down the cap. 
We're going to back them up with a secondary force of mercs. That are going to sit here. And the rest are just going to wait for the war to be over, basically. So let's do it. Oh god, these guys have, are, are, have not been replenishing. God, neither of these. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay, we do have another omen now, so we are losing a little bit less AE. But to be honest, I'm not sure I'm going to need it, man. I am not sure I'm going to need it. Let's get research points. We can try and catch up with tech. Because we are behind on tech right now. Let's, uh, let's move our forces up and just get ready. Oh, hey, hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? 13th of February. Mm. All right. Whoa! Oh, there it is. I forgot they have a big old army. Okay, let's uh, let's reinforce this. They should be fine. Unfortunately, we are going to be attacking into hills. That's a bit of a problem. Get them, boys. Get them. Let's give this guy that. We're trying to reinforce them a little bit. Ooh, they're coming. I think we did a bad fight here. Oh, we win! We actually are victorious, killing 6,000 forces, which means we get to be the defenders. Hell yeah. And thank god we have this commander. That's what really saved us here. But now, there we go. Great. Now, tactics-wise, I think we should try and stick to... I think bottleneck would probably be a good tactic right now. These guys are replenishing. Oh, that's the stuff. Come on, hurry up. There it is. These mercs are taking so long. The Herculean path, a huge influx of visitors lately, and reputation being the city's Hercules pass through. How much you to build upon the myth and honor the hero? Lose 50 village power and get tax and army movement speed. Or hold a small festival and lose 200 cash and get morale of armies and discipline. Yes. That's 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 gonna help a lot. Uh, obviously, it's gonna hurt our manpower quite a bit, but that's okay. So I actually don't. I actually have a bunch of omen power spare now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna promote uh, a couple. Uh, convert some of these slaves to. I'm gonna promote a few slaves, and then promote a few freemen. Just try and get a little bit more. Uh, a little bit better pop balance going on here. Because I really would like to make sure I do have a sufficient number of citizens. Just kind of running around promoting people willy-nilly. And our episodes are definitely running very long. Well, in the next episode, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to promote a few people into the correct citizen ratio to try and increase our tech advances. We're going to annex Pontus and then rotate west to attack Thrace and full annex them, making us... Uh, what are we gonna get? 600, we're gonna get 300, we're gonna get about six to 700 pop in this war. Almost, like, 35% more pop, dude, it's gonna be great. I was Azure, I'll continue to be, this has been some Imperator. Thank you so much for watching, bye-bye.